so I just got caught in a tremendous downpour uh, a few minutes ago. I kind of got to jump in under an awning for a minute while I was walking, but uh, um, I just want to I want to show something, something I talk about, something that you should see, something to pay attention to. Check this out. All right, everything's wet. Okay, it really came down a few minutes ago. Florida, get these pop-ups. This is something that happens here again. Soil super sandy. Um, a lot of the time, stuff passes right through, and I always kind of make the comment that it could rain inches and be dry. You can't see any standing water anywhere around here. Definitely not on this property. Um, and if we're going to go in here and take a look, I'm just going to kind of open up the ground here and see it's it's wet. Okay, it's wet. So look. Look, is it? It's pretty dry. There's nothing to really grip or hold on to. Not enough organic matter in the soil, and therefore, everything kind of has to grab quickly. So now, I'm still on this lawn that we treated half of the other day, and um, just kind of letting it do its thing. This is, the, this is the side that we treated over here. The other side is back there behind me. Now, this rain ought to make things start to move um, pretty quickly. But that's the thing that I want people to take a look at, especially when we're talking about irrigation and uh, rainfall and things of that nature. Uh, it just, sky opened up a second ago. There's uh, tornado warnings and all kinds of stuff happening right now. Um, and it's like, Aside from the water on the, gra the grass itself, uh, dig down in the soil. There's there's nothing there. So, you know, keep that in mind, you guys who are uh, irrigating in sandy soils. It takes a lot to fill this pan to get that ground to uh, actually be sustainable for the roots. But I, I'm just going to dig in here. You guys know how much I love to do that. Does that just look like it poured on us? No. This is why that conversation of leaching and runoff is so important. That right there. So we want to build those roots, we want to get them deeper, build that organic matter, and actually be able to utilize some of this incredible rainfall. So there you go. Soaking wet, stuff still dripping, dry as a bone.